for our warm up today, I am going to teach you a song that is my favourite song to sing with pupils in primary one and primary two. Normally, I would have taught you this song already at school, but because we've not been allowed to sing this year in school, then we're getting a chance to do it now for home learning. So the song is all about bananas and how much I love bananas. So I'll do one line at a time. I'll sing a line and then it'll be your turn and you can copy and that's how we'll learn the chorus of the song. Are you ready? Bananas, bananas, bananas are the best. Your turn. Bananas, bananas, bananas are the best. A soft, squishy middle and a big yellow vest. Your turn. A soft, squishy middle and a big yellow vest. Today or manana, today or manana, I'll be saying canna, I'll be saying canna, can I have a banana? Can I have a banana? Let's try the chorus all together, all the way through. After four. One, two, three, four. Bananas, bananas, bananas are the best. A soft, squishy middle and a big yellow vest. Today or manana, I'll be saying can I, can I have a banana? For the next bit, I'll sing a line and then when there's a pause, I want you to shout bananas, nice and loud. Are you ready? What am I gonna have for my tea? Bananas. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. What's my Sunday dinner gonna be? Can I have a banana? Bananas, bananas, bananas are the best. A soft, squishy middle and a big yellow vest. Today or mañana, I'll be saying, can I have a banana? Fifty million monkeys can't be wrong. Bananas. For Toti wants to okay come. They all have to sing the song. Can I have a banana? Bananas, bananas, bananas are the best. The soft, squishy middle and a big. I hope you like the song and I'm really hoping that one day soon we can all sing it together in school. So today we are learning to explore high pitch and low pitch. Now that we're warmed up, let's find out what we're going to be learning today. We're going to start by listening to a piece of music by an English composer called Vaughan Williams. A composer is somebody who writes music. This piece of music is called The Lark Ascending. A lark is a type of bird, and here's a picture. While we listen to the music, I might ask some questions and you could be having a think about the answers to those questions. What do you think the lark is doing?
Do you think the lark is happy or sad? Is the lark flying high in the sky or close to the ground? I hope you enjoyed listening to the music. What we're going to do next is we're going to listen to a short section and this time I want you to move around the room. You could dance, you could just move up and down. Maybe if the music goes up high, you could stretch up high and if the music goes down low, you could stretch down low. next task I have made a lark and my lark is flying as you can see he can fly way up high or way down low I wonder what sound he might make when he flies way up high could you make a bird sound that's up high like the lark tweet 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 you have a go I wonder what he might sound like when he flies way down low. Can you make a bird sound that's low like the lark? Tweet, 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 tweet. Your turn. Pitch is the high and low in music or high and low sound in your voice. So I want you to watch the lark and I want you to make high and low pitched sounds with your voice, depending on if the lark is high or low. You might make a bird sound like we just did, or you might make a different type of sound, any sound that you want to make with your mouth. I'm going to use an oo sound because I find that a little bit easier than a tweet. I'll show you what I mean. So watch the lark and listen to my voice. Oo. Kind of silly but it's quite fun. Have another go now. Watch the lark and make high pitch or low pitch sounds. Are you ready?
How did you get on? What I would like you to do is either make a lark like my one, which you could use, or you could use something you have in your house like a, a bird teddy and I would like you to listen to the next little bit of the music and I would like you to move your lark, your bird, up high when the music's high pitched and down low when the music's low pitched. I would love to see some photos or a video of how you get on by exploring high and low using your bird. So your task Make your own lark or use a toy bird that you have already. Listen to the music again and make the bird fly high when the music goes high and low when the music goes low. I would love to see photos and videos and if you post these on your teams or let me know how you get on on teams, that would be great.